I had no idea what this dog breed was, nor how to draw it when my work colleague requested this video, but I did my research and I became quite the expert in this breed. Well, not really, but I did break it down into three broad steps, which I'm going to share with you here and give you the name of the dog breed. We're going to start off our Bellington Whippet with a circle just here on the left hand side of the page. Circle doesn't have to be perfect. If you want a hack for drawing circles, you'll find it in the description below. So just a circle like that, lightly in pencil. We're now going to be drawing an oval shape to the right hand side. This is going to form the back of the dog. So just a very simple oval shape. Doesn't have to be perfect. These are just preparatory shapes just to help us with the body. Sometimes what I do when I do these how-to videos, I watch them the whole way through and then go back and then pause the video. So if I go to quickly, just pause the video. Draw a little line across, that's the back. Now we're going to be doing the head, which is just another simple oval shape, just to the left-hand side of this circle. Now this is much smaller than the other ones, so just draw a simple oval shape like this. Remember to pause the video while you're doing it. Now we're going to be drawing the muzzle. Just a straight line coming downwards like this and then curves round and joins up with that oval shape. Now for the neck, which comes down like this and then the back of the neck, which goes round like that. We're going to put in the ear, a simple V shape, just like that. Now for the eye, a little dot. Well, that's not hard, is it? Now for the leg. So just here at the bottom, if you imagine the middle of the bottom here, just go to the right hand side a little bit. Straight line coming down. Doesn't, you don't have to use a ruler. And then the little paw at the end. We're going to be drawing the underside of the belly. So here where we did the leg, draw a line going upwards to join the oval. We're going to be drawing the top of the leg now. So. Just follow what I'm doing. Have a look at what I'm doing first and then copy. So a shape like this. Okay. Then we're going to come around to the side. And there's going to be a kink here. Come down. And then the paw. We're going to be doing that for the other hind leg. So just peeping out round behind here. A kink and then a paw. There we go. I'm just going to make this leg just a fraction longer. There we go. Now for the tail. So just a line like so. Right, I'm going to be changing to pen, but please carry on in pencil. This is just so that you can see it better on camera. So we're going to be starting off with the head. So on this straight part of the nose, this is the easiest part to start off with. Just draw a line going upwards drawing the little nose on the end so just a little nose like that now for the mouth curved one like this and then we're going to do the top of the head so I'm going to be drawing lots of these little wispy lines this is to show that it's really quite a shaggy a shaggy furred dog so you'll see me doing a lot of those lines we're going to be doing the ear now it's coming down and then round like so now for the eye, there's quite a lot of fur covering the eye, so you'll just see what I do. So a little eye just peeping out there, leave a little gap white so it shows the reflection of the light. Draw a bit of fur, there we go. Now I'm going to be drawing fur around the mouth and underneath the chin, just like this. There we go. And then we're going to be following the neck coming downwards. So it's thought that the first Bedlington Whippet was bred in the 1990s. And they're a mix of the Bedlington Terrier and their Whippet parents. Just come down right like that. We're then going to do the back of this front leg. So the fur is actually horizontal. So I'm going to be drawing some fur like this horizontally. All along this line that we we sketched in before. Until we get to the ground, then we're going to be drawing the paw. There we go. Now for the front of this leg, which comes up like so. 
just like that. We're then going to put in the other front leg. So this one's just peeking out. You don't see much of it. This one has the paw slightly higher. Just like that. Easy, wasn't it? Now for the back. So we're going to come round down here. Remember to do these kind of like flicky lines just to show that it's very furry. There we go, coming down. So they usually have a life expectancy between 12 and 15 years. Okay, now we're coming down to do the hind leg. Got to here, we're gonna follow this line that we did before. I'm gonna do a few more flicky lines till we reach the ground. Then for the paw, just like this. And then we're gonna do the front of this leg, coming upwards coming round and then we're going to follow that shape that we did before for the leg. This has lots of fur on this leg. Till we reach just a little bit higher than this oval shape. Then going to do the belly again lots of flicky lines this time going downwards so vertically till we reach here just like so. And then the other hind leg, so this is the back of the hind leg, and the paw coming upwards, coming round for the other hind leg. All that's left is the tail, so I've got quite a whippet tail, so long and thin. Just like so. So if you haven't gone over it already, go over it in pen and then erase all the pencil lines like this. Okay, I've erased all the pencil lines. We're just gonna add a little bit of shading underneath here in the darker areas. So just adding a bit more shading here and on the other hind leg, just behind this one that's in the foreground. A little bit underneath the tail just behind the fore, um, the forelimb, just here, and on this leg as well. A little bit underneath the, the head, coming down. A little bit underneath the ear as well, and underneath the chin. Show that it's super shaggy. And then we're going to be drawing just a little bit of shadow underneath the dog, just with some horizontal lines to show that it's not floating in the air. And there's your finished super simple Bedlington Whippet. If you've enjoyed this one, you're going to absolutely love the whole playlist of dogs, so get drawing now.